Fiat IDF 2012, which has come out of the keynotes. And the Ultrabook uh, booth is open here, so I'm just going to go over. We'll have a take a look around. So here's one I wanted to look at, the Toshiba 925T, it's the 920 T in Europe, and it's the, the slider. Ivy Bridge Core i5, 1366x768 screen. This one's running window 8, as you can see. It's a glossy screen here, but uh, as you can see, Windows 8 is uh, running, and there's a bunch of apps. Oh, don't get that one in Germany. That's a shame. Anyway, um, where's the desktop? Here we go. What we want to show you, of course, is the uh, slider mechanism. So I was just going to quickly uh, demo that. It's, it is a slider mechanism. It's not, uh, you know, the twist convertible there. So you end up with a device that's what I guess about 20 to 22 millimeters thick there, about 1.3, 1.4 kilos. So you know, three pounds is a little bit heavier than you might like a tablet. In fact, you know, double the size of a normal sort of tablet weight. But you do get some sort of convertible capability there. There's the Windows 8 button there that will flip you back between. The, late, the Metro and the last app you used. Let's have a quick look around the device. There is, oh, what is that? I mean, it's, uh, yes. That is, ah, okay, that's an SD card port there with a headphone port on the side. This is USB 3 here, full HDMI, some vents. And then on this side, power button, volume rocker switch, there's a wi looks like a Wi-Fi off, no, it's a lock, rotate lock button, maybe even a touch lock button, another USB 3, nothing on the front. There's a power so there you go, and there it is as an Ultrabook, a traditional laptop uh, style. Let's just um, try type, typing on this, well just have a little feel of the keyboard. That's typical uh, Toshiba, it feels very much like the U820, uh, actually almost exactly the same as the U820. Maybe a slightly different bit of, uh, extra bit of travel there. Quite a small uh, touchpad there, not sure if it's uh, multi-touch enabled, but I imagine it will be. I can't actually see whether it is there, I'm not sure what this is here. But this is due in Q4, of course, it's a Windows 8 uh, device, so uh, when Windows 8 gets launched, mid end of October, I expect uh, we're going to have uh, prices and stuff on this. I'm actually going to go see Toshiba in Europe um, in about two weeks' time, so we're going to get uh, some more demos of this one. Stay tuned to ultrabooknews.com. Thanks. This is